Asalaamu As Alaikum and hello everyone. Welcome back again. So uh, last night was uh, night 12 of the 30 night challenge. I hope you enjoyed the exercises last night. Uh, tonight will be night 13. So the video will be uploaded to YouTube uh, very shortly after this at 6 p.m. You're good to go for night 13. Um, so the exercise that I picked from tonight's circuit, um, I'm going to start working a little bit on pyelometrics. So just kind of little hops or little jumps, etc. But as always, you know, if, if, there's, if there are issues with your mobility, knees, etc., there's always variation. So as always, I'm going to show you different variations. So the, the move today is going to be a it's going to be a forward jump and it's going to it's, it's going to involve a burpee and a backward pedal. Just to um, I put the backward pedal in there as well, because um, just to make uh, it's like I said, it's good for the pyelometrics, uh, it's good for cardio. Um, because you're going to be doing the burpee and the backward pedal is good for spatial awareness. So it could be general spatial awareness or it could be in a combat situation, whether you're uh, on an open mat um, sparring or whether you're in a ring or if it's mixed martial arts, you're in, in one of those uh, cages. You need to be aware the opponents come into you, the distance and you know if the fence is behind you, you need to be aware of what's behind you, moving to the side, moving back. So I've incorporated bits of that into, into the 39 challenge. So I'll show you the level one to start off with and then there'll be a level two and a slight variation for level three. So if I show you level one first, so start in this position here. So depending on the space that you have, so the space I have, I'm gonna stay, stay close to the wall so I've got more space to jump. So for, actually for level one, we're not going to jump. For level one, we're going to take two forward steps. So if you can, you're going to go one, we're going to go two. So obviously depending on, listen to your body, see what you can do. If you've got new issues, make it make them smaller steps. Two steps forward, and from here, as always, I'm going to go into a burpee. So here, I'll show you from the front as well. So we're going to be here, back, back, up, up. Then we're going to squeeze our glutes in a standing position, and then we're going to take two backward steps and back into position. So that's level one. So the burpee from the front, I've shown you the burpee before, but I'll show you from the front. So for level one, make sure your knees are slightly bent. Your hands are gonna go inside, just inside your uh, line of uh, your uh, toe, in the, your, your uh, big toe. Because if you start doing it from out here, you'll start getting uh, shoulder issues. So here, step back, step back. Make sure you're uh, uh, engaging your core. Step up, step up. Stand up in a standing position here. Make sure you squeeze your glutes, your bottom. So you're working, you know, multiple muscle groups. So that, that was level one. So level two, so from here, again, uh, make sure your knees are slightly bent. You're gonna explode off your toes, and when you land, you're gonna try to land softly, but again, knees slightly bent. So we're here, engage your core, jump here in this position, and then you've got two options. So level two is gonna be the, the full burpee. So here, onto the floor. So that split second on the floor, then you're gonna hop back up onto your toes again, Knees bent, squeeze your glutes, squeeze your glutes and quick backward, two, two backward pedals. So for level three, from here, we're gonna jump. Rather than do the full burpee where you're touching the floor, we're gonna do the sprawl. So as I've shown you before, the sprawl is slightly harder because as you land into it, you're not, you're not putting your body weight on the floor, you're landing on your hands and your feet. So I'll show you from the side position, we're gonna be here, we're gonna go sprawl here, so slight angle, so if you can see now, on my, my, I'm on my toes on my hands here. I'm not here for level two. So it's like a, almost like a press up and you're using your core, you're squeezing your glutes more. And from here, I'm gonna mm -hmm. jump, I'll jump back up and quickly backward pedal into position again. So it's, like I said, for spatial awareness or in a sparring uh, situation, you're angling back out and you can always move to the side. So that's, that's the move just to, like I said, to build up on what we've done in the previous uh, 12 nights and to start working a bit more on pyelometrics for uh, level two, level three and for level ones rather than a normal stride and taking a bigger stride. So it utilizes that energy a bit more. So I hope you found that uh, video useful um, and I'll see you tonight for night 13 of the 39 challenge.